Hello and welcome to a quick tutorial on how to play Diablo 2 on modern systems like Windows 10. The first thing you're going to be checking for is the D2 video test. So you're going to be finding your Diablo 2 folder and then scrolling down until you see this little part here. Now in most cases when you click on it you will get this little pop-up but if this doesn't work for you you're going to be doing into properties and then you're going to go into compatibility and then you're going to be run this program in compatibility mode and then select Windows XP Service Pack 3 uh, the other packs could probably work as well but just go with X, uh, Windows XP and then you run this test and when the test is over which takes like a minute you're going to be selecting either 2D or 3D I would go over 2D because I believe that sometimes it kind of bugs out due to uh, uh, display drivers and modern graphic cards kind of being messed up with the 3D option. But yeah, just go over 2D. If it do if it works for 3D, great. But in most cases, it will only work with the 2D option. Another thing you then need to do is go for the same thing here. You're gonna go into compatibility mode and then you're going to be trying run this program in compatibility mode and then go with service pack in most cases you don't need to do this after you are done the Diablo 2 video test but in case this might work for you this is another option um, besides these two things there are also some things like updating your drivers your graphic drivers that might sometimes help I have even heard about people uh, downgrading their uh, graphic drivers, but I don't think that would matter too much. But in general, update everything you can, do a clean install. Um, yeah, I don't think there's much more to say about that. I'm always interested in more ways to make this game run, because I personally haven't had much problem with this before. But um, one thing I will mention though is that maybe the game works good in Windows mode for you and how to get that is just by adding this little line here in the properties window that might also be another way to fix the game in in modern systems but um, yeah I want you to keep this video short and I hope you found it useful goodbye